Let's listen to Dr. David Turner's thoughts on preventative medicine. David Turner, I'm from uh, Franklin, Tennessee. My main practice is in Columbia, Tennessee, which is uh, about 45 minutes south of Nashville. Been, uh, I was an emergency doctor for 22 years, went back to family practice setting three years ago. And when I hit 50, I began to experience some the effects of aging on myself. I began to explore what I could do to, to reverse some of those effects. And it led me to a number of courses through here through WorldLink. And then I'm, my practice has expanded. 50% of my practice is now hormone replacement and age management. Uh, I've lost 37 pounds, that was a few, couple of years ago, uh, by implementing the hormone replacement, uh, including thyroid replacement. I also uh, use some growth hormone replacement as well. But all of it's been uh, beneficial. Of course, I combine that with a healthy lifestyle. I still try to eat properly and exercise regularly. Uh, it's not all just uh, hormones. It's, uh, it's also the whole lifestyle piece. Someone asked me the other day what my retention rate was. I would say probably 95%. Um, I could quote one, one uh, elderly patient of mine. She was 73. Six weeks after we initiated the hormone uh, replacement, she, her words were, I'm back. She'd been experiencing confusion, you know, de decreased cognition. Um, a lot of physical complaints as well, but within six weeks, she and her family all felt that she was truly back to the lady she had been a number of years before. Very, very rewarding. Yeah, word of mouth is tremendous. We do have a, a large number of patients. And, uh, I treat also suboptimal thyroid, and so uh, a lot of people have been searching for some doctors to do that, to get the, the thyroid maximized. And uh, that, that's led to a lot of referrals by word of mouth as well, by taking care of that appropriately. As well as uh, even young and middle-aged women with polycystic ovary syndrome. Uh, tremendous response to those treatments as well. Often the cosmetic patients become hormone or age management repl replacement patients and sometimes the, hoard, the age management patients become aesthetics patients. So it's, it's been very de uh, beneficial to us that way. Most of the information that I use has come from Neil's uh, lectures. Uh, one of the things I, I truly appreciate is the scientific evidence-based nature of these uh, talks and that I can go back with a complete sense of confidence that I'm doing what is in the literature. Uh, even though a lot of my colleagues may not understand that because they may have not been uh, brought up to speed on, on the literature in this area, at least I'm very confident that I know what I'm doing. I was in the, the illness business for many, many years as an emergency physician. And what we're trying to do here is really take the approach to wellness. And uh, the traditional Western medical paradigm of the illness works very well for ill patients, for trauma patients. But unfortunately, they have not caught on to this point on the preventative aspects of hormone replacement as far as wellness goes. So there's a whole wealth of information out there. So I would encourage anyone interested uh, to, to, to look into it.